we're going to cover double row and double column elimination in this Sudoku Primer video. This is a hard puzzle, number 84 from Sudoku to Go, volume 115 by Soap Opera Digest. Uh, this has some really good examples of double row and double column elimination right at the beginning of the video. Uh, so let's just jump right in. First of all, we notice we've only got three numbers here. One, three, four, one, three, four. But we can't solve any of them. We got a one and a four here, and that's it. Um, so let's let's just get going on the sections. One. One can go anywhere there. 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 One. One, one. Okay. Now, in this section right here, we have a one here, one of these two places, and a one here, and one of these two places. Therefore, both of these columns are covered. We don't need a one, we can't have a one here, here, or here. So we know the one goes right here. And that's what we call double column elimination. So we got, if this is a one, then that's a one. And if this is a one, that's a one. So this one has to be in this box, has to be in this, in this column. Okay. Uh, let's continue. Two. There's a two there. Two. Three. Three, uh, three, three. One of these is a three, uh, but this is a an example of double row elimination because we've got a three here and a three here. So one of these has to be a three, and over here one of these has to be a three. That covers both these rows, so we know one of these is a three. We already knew that, but uh, that helps out. But something also interesting, okay, we've got a 3 here and a 3 here, so one of these is a 3. We've got a 3 here, so one of these is a 3. So therefore, we've got double column elimination here. This column and this column, one of those is a 3 and one of these is a 3. That covers both these columns. So the 3 in the middle has to be in the middle column, in this middle box here. So we know that middle cell in box 5 is a 3. And now because of that we can fill in the 1 and 4. Okay. Alright, let's keep going. 4. Okay, there's a 4 there. Okay, so we got 4. 4. Uh, 4. Four, 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 four. Okay, here's another example of double column elimination. We've got a four here, so four has to be in one of these two columns. And down here, the four has to be in the same two columns. So we know one of these is a four. Now you all can also see that because there's a four here. So one of these has to be a four because that can't be a four. But there are times when you can't see it that uh, that readily, and double column elimination will will make it so you can see it easier. Okay, five. There's a five right there. There's a five. Okay. So now we've got a five here. One of these two is a five. Oh, one of those. Okay. Can't solve those yet. Six. Six. 
six, 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 six. Here's another example of double column elimination. We've got a six here and a six here, so one of these is a six. One of these has to be a six, even though we don't have sixes up here. One of these has to be a six, because we have a wall here. So therefore, this is a six. So we know one of these is a six. What do we have here? We got one, six, eight. One, six, and eight. So that's a one, eight. Okay, there's a one here, so these are six, eight twins. So that's a one. But before we filled out that one, we could see that one of these had to be a six with double column elimination. Okay, we can't solve those right now, but uh, we know those are six eight twins. Okay, let's go to sevens. Oh, here we have five seven twins. Right here, five seven twins. All right, let's we'll look at that in just a minute. Let's do eights. Eight, 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 there, and uh, eight, eight. But now uh, we know that these are six eight twins. Um, so we know the 8 goes in this column. You can also see that here, because there's an 8 here. One of these is an 8, and one of those is an 8. So the 8 has to be here. All right, and then 9s. 9. Nine. Okay, now let's look at these five, seven twins here. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So one of these is an eight. Oh, there's an eight there. So we know that's an eight. And that's a one. Okay, so five sevens right there. So we know this is a nine. We can't solve the five sevens yet, but uh, we know the, those are the only ones left there. Okay, let's uh, look at let's look at some of these rows now. Or I'm going to go over the sections one more time, see if we've got anything new. One, 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 two, two, Threes, three, three, three. There's a three. Okay, that tells us one of these is a three. Um, of course, we've got everything else fi filled in here, so these are three fours. Three four twins here. We have six eights here. All right. Okay. Three, three. There's a three right there. So that's a three. Three, 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 three. Okay. Fours. Four, four there. Okay, so we know these are one fours now. We knew these were ones. Now we got fours. So what's left? There's a 
two left there. So there's a two. So one of these is a two here. Did we do we have twins for that? Let's see. Two eights. Yeah, two eight twins there. We also know where this one is. We got ones there, and we've filled in a one there, so we can fill in that one. Okay, we still need ones here and ones here. Let's look at this row right here. We've got two eights here. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Six and nine on the outside here. Nine there, nine there. So that's a nine. That's a six. Okay, now we've got six sixes or four sixes. So that's a six. We got two eights here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's a seven. Okay, so seven, seven. So that's a seven. All right, seven, seven, seven. What are we missing here? A nine. Nine, nine, nine. It's two eights there still. Four sixes here. Okay, two, eight, four, six. Let's look at this column right here. Two, five, two fives. Okay, there's a two, so that's a five. And therefore, our five, seven twins are, are filled in, and then that's a two right there. Okay, so now we got two, two, two. Two, two, two. All right, here's a single number. Five, six, seven, eight. That's a nine. Nines. Do we have all our nines now? No, we don't have nines here. Six eights. And what else are we missing? Four nines. Is that right? No, nope, four there. One. Five. Five nines. So two eights, five nines, six eights. Can't solve any of those yet. Let's look at this column right here. Four, six, eight. Four, six, eight. There's a six, so four, eight. Four, six, eight. Four, six. These are three fours. And this is one, it's a seven there, so one, three, four is one, what's left? One, two, three, four, five, six, one, six, eight. Okay, so we can't solve any of those. Uh, let's see. Let's just go through the rows. We got two eights there, four sixes there. Uh, let's look at this row right here. Five, six, eight. Five, six, and eight are missing. There's a five, six. So that's an eight. Therefore, we've got an eight here. Eight, eight, eight. This is two eight. This is uh, let's see, one, two, three, five, six, eight, nine. So we got two eight, eight, nine, five, six here. There's a six, five, six. That's a five. I didn't draw that, write that very well. Okay, so five, five, there's a five right there. One of these is a five. Okay, so two eights, eight nines. We have six, eight here, so what was that? Five sixes? No, six, eight. Six, seven, eight, 
that's a 9. So that's 8, 9 there, and 2, 8 there. Okay, we're still missing our 6, 8, and our 4, 5, 6, 7. So 4, 7. Let's see, now we're missing a 6 there and a 4 there. 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 1, 6 is there. 3, 4 is there. 6, 8 is there. There's an 8. So 6, 8, 1, 6. 3, 4 is what's missing here. 5, 2, 8. 5, 2, 8. 9, 6, 3. 9, 6, 3. 3 is missing there. So 1, 4 is, that's right. Yeah, well, there's a 1 there. 4, 1. And so 3, 4 is. Okay, that's it. So uh, I hope the double row and double column elimination technique will help you on your future puzzle solving. And uh, I appreciate your watching. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe to my channel. That helps me quite a bit and it doesn't cost you anything. And I would appreciate it. And also, uh, Go visit uh, sudokuprimer.com. There are techniques, uh, there's a video index out there. There's a lot of different things that you can, uh, a lot of good information out there. You can also download uh, blank Sudoku grids from that uh, website. Well, thanks for watching, and uh, I hope this one's help was helpful for you.